Each Monday, we introduce you to a city shaper, someone making an impact in our community. And we featured many entrepreneurs. And tonight, Two On Your Side's Kelly Dudzik introduces us to a Cheektowaga business owner who has found success in crafting after overcoming several challenges. This week, we're at Favors and Gifts in Cheektowaga, where the owner started crafting more than 40 years ago. I grew up in West Seneca. And when I turned 18, I moved to Cheektowaga. Not going to tell you how old I am <laughs> now, but I've been in Cheektowaga all my adult life. Barbara Zwick owns Favors and Gifts on William Street in Cheektowaga. 90% of the crafts in the store are handmade either by Barbara or her husband. How did you start your love of crafting and how did you end up owning your own business? Well, I always wanted to do something for myself. Um, I had a couple of friends that introduced me to crafting. I didn't think that I was crafty, but I guess everybody has their own niche. And when I found mine, I realized I could do more than what I ever expected. Before she knew it, Barbara was hooked. She started her own business in 1971. Her husband, Barry, learned how to paint and do woodworking, which came in handy to keep the business going when Barbara was diagnosed with cancer twice in the 90s. I'm not in remission, so to speak, but I say I'm in remission because I'm still here. Even though I'm fighting, I'm still here. Barbara also survived a bad accident, which meant Barry's support meant even more to her. I ended up paralyzed from my neck down. First thing that came back were my hands. I began to get busy. Thus, God blessed me with more talents. And I just continued to progress more and more work. The more I did, the more I was able to do. And all of a sudden, the business just started flourishing to what it is today. The Zwicks moved their shop from Snyder to Cheektowaga in 2003. What advice do you have for people who start something fresh from the ground up like what you did? It was our dream. And I think now our dream is coming true. But it is hard doing a one place thing now because people do a lot on the internet. I'm hoping still to draw people in here who like to feel things, like to see things, touch things, smell things. Um, I prefer to do that myself. And Barbara hopes to continue crafting for years to come. In Cheektowaga, Kelly Dudzik, Channel 2 News. Thank you, Kelly. And if you would like to nominate someone to be a city shaper, just go to the city shapers section of WGRZ.com and send Kelly an email.